Alright, welcome back to another exciting Shovel Knight stream, everybody. Last time was a crazy stream. We fought the Battle Toads, and I didn't even know they were in the game, and we got this cool new green froggy armor, which I'm... Are you having cake? I'm not sure what the green froggy armor is going to do, but we only have one level left in this third trio, and then we're off to the final area. But before we head on... Actually, no. We're going to head on over to the stranded ship, Lair of Polar Knight, right now. And see what the frog foggy armor's out. For chivalry! Okay, interesting. So we use the shovel as like a spear? If this is anything like the Kratos armor, I might not want to actually use this. Although, I do love Polar Knight stage. Yes, it has ice physics, which I normally don't like, but the music is really good. Oh my gosh! We just uppercutted him. I'm not sure how we did the uppercut, but I, I'd like to do that again, please. That was really good. So the frog armor is interesting. I'm not sure if I would keep using it for the whole game, but... Like, I feel like we're not dealing damage to enemies that we should be dealing damage to. We can combo them, but... Hmm. Hmm, I, I don't know about this. Oh my gosh! The combo's really cool, but... That might screw things up a little bit. I guess we still have the pogo. Oh shoot, we should have pogoed off of that guy. Boom! It was very ice of them to put this level in the game, yes. Let's go fishing! Ice fishing! Haha. <laughs> That's what we want to see. Nice golden fish. Yeah, I am not a fan of the froggy armor. The fact that your default stab doesn't damage enemies, that's terrible. Hey, Value Your Inputs, welcome to the stream. We're trying out this new set of armor in Shovel Knight, and I don't like it. The pogos are good, but the generic attack doesn't seem to damage enemies. Hey, Mobius, welcome. I actually don't know why I'm breaking the checkpoints. I have no further use for money in this game. I think we've bought literally everything. Hey, Nintendo Attic, yeah. I mean, the pogos are nice. I like how big the first pogo is, but... The generic attack don't seem to deal damage, which means Polar Knight is gonna be a whole lot harder. Polar Knight's difficulty will definitely be up if we can't damage him by just swinging our shovel at him! Okay! Oh no, no, we can't do this. Oh, great! And I didn't make a checkpoint. Okay, nope. We're gonna get our money back, and then we're gonna leave and change the armor. The armor is actually going to kill me. It literally just did. It's like the Kratos armor, where it pierces through the dirt claw the dirt clods and kills you. No thank you. At least with the big shovel it does. <laughs> Sp 
Spikes are always dangerous in video games, especially if your name is Mega Man. Darn it, I had such high hopes for the froggy armor, too. There we go. No, not back to the title screen. Return to the map. Okay, no. I'll off to the armor outpost to change our armor. Oh no, now that you've saved the Battletoads, you can change your armor. Better not be the case. Okay. Oh, that's right, we could run with it, but nah, not worth it. Alright, the plate and the gold plate are not very good. The Conjurer's Coat is interesting, but I don't like how you take double damage when you have that equipped. Should we go Dynamo Mail or the Mail of Momentum, folks? Or I will also go Ornate Plate or Final Guard. What color should we do? Actually, you know what? I'll even do the Conjurer's Code as well. Basically, anything that's not green, <laughs> I will wear. What, what does chat think? I will put my trust implicitly in Twitch chat for a, a suit of armor that is not green. If nobody's gonna vote, then I'm gonna choose one for you. Alright, we gotta vote for the purple! If I get the purple one, I'm absolutely using more of the magic stuff. You choose done! That's- that's- wait, that's not a choice! <laughs> Alright, we'll go the Conjurer's Coat. We haven't worn it yet. We now all of a sudden have 150 magic to work with. Alright, back to Polar Knight. Again. I don't... I'm trying to remember. Is there anything left to buy? I don't think so. We bought all the armor. We bought all the shovel upgrades. Or I guess we still have to buy the remaining relic from this level, but that's it. Ah. Generic shovel swing. It's good to have you back. Ha ha! I forgot, I don't like ice physics. Whoops! Wee wee wee! Hey Sonic, what's up? Welcome to the stream! Where we've already lost a good amount of our money. Take that, you stupid ice wolf. Aha, but we got the money back. We got the money back, money back, money back. We got the money back, money back, mo Oh. Actually, wait. Oh, dog on it. I was like, wait a second, folks. If we, like, precisely hit these ice blocks, right, we could still get the gems, but no, we couldn't. Good job. Shoot. I've said it before, there are only really two games that I actually like ice physics in. And they are Ultimate Chicken Horse, because the ice physics can help you out and take cool shortcuts, and Rayman 1. Because it's fun. Oh shoot, I gotta pay attention to my health a bit more. Ice Cap is a pretty great zone, I will give it to you. It also doesn't have as much ice physics as some of the other ice zones. I love how I'm like, I'm gonna use more of the mana stuff, and then I didn't. Having the propeller dagger is gonna make this level easier.
Wait a second, I have the Dust Knuckles. That could have ended badly. I almost dust knuckled right off a cliff. And then where would I be? Ha ha, take that! Are you watching a certain guy named Artie Stream Shovel Knight? Because that's what all the cool kids are doing tonight. Oh, I was at 1 HP. <laughs> yeah, you are, Mobius. I can't believe you're watching me play this over watching Tomato play your Lemmings pack. Because Tomato is streaming Moby Lens right now. I've always said that Artie and World War II documentaries go hand in hand. <laughs> oh, you're watching both. Okay. <laughs> Good. Boom. Alright, let's try this again. This time with less failure. Do -do 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 -do. The Magic Mail is, like, technically the most optimal when it comes to speedrunning, but it's really hard for me to use. I'm Basic Boy. I don't need all these fancy, uh, tools. Ah, good, a checkpoint. And now, oh, and now we get to ride the platforms that give us Rainbow Barf that actually, like, create solid ground. Thank you, Rainbow Barf. Oh, how did you know exactly where I was going to be? Come on. That's because Artie's not real. Artie is just a fake person. If there's ever a colorful Artie iceberg, number one on the the top or the very bottom of the iceberg is colorful Artie is not real. Along with my ex-wife. On Rainbow Barf. Propeller Dagger is really fun to use, though. Ha ha! I, I think Mobius has heard of Artie for a while now. Oh ho! Oh, 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 oh. Nyo, 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 nyo. Nice try. <sighs> Gotta go fishing. Gotta go nuclear fishing. Wait a second, it's the trouble. Oh, I need to drink more stuff to get that from the trouble cane. Too bad. Wow, I just... Did it give my charge shots, like, a magic orb around them? Or does that guy just blow up in a magical pattern? Aha! 
Polar Knight? What kind of a person would put bombs underneath a dinner plate? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Nice try. Hey, Chester! In the village or out in the field, I have all the deals. You're not gonna believe what I just found. The Warhorn! Clear space around you with a powerful blow. Oh, this will be fun to use our magic on. <laughs> That's a fun one. It's expensive, but hey, we got so much magic. Shoop! That is the lesson of my stream as well, Sonic. Nice tie-in. Today, kids, I want to tell you about communism. <laughs> and why schools don't teach you about it. Oh, oh, no! No, no, no! Rainbow Barf! <laughs> no! Glad I didn't break this tempting checkpoint. Do 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 do. <laughs> I think my problem was I didn't use Blitzkrieg. Alright, stupid snow dog. There we go. I used a pacifistic Blitzkrieg. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. It's true. If there's one thing that I learned playing Advance Wars, it's that you use your infantry as meat shields for your tanks. Infantry are not important. They can literally just... They're expendable because they only cost a thousand more to get more. But your tanks, those are seven thousand. You gotta take care of your tanks. Uh-oh. I don't think I'm getting my money back. At least not all of it. No, wait, I can get my money back. I'll have to die again, but it'll be worth it. Hey! Those bags were higher up before I died. the money bag. I don't know why I'm trying to save my money. I don't need it anymore, but... Oh, wait. I can get all of this back, at least. There we go. Well, true. Also, spam pipe runners. That is the best thing to do in Advance Wars. They're, they're the best. They can only move on pipes, and they're super expensive. They're great! Okay, I was not expecting that. Thank you, Propeller Dagger. Why are there Frody flying lizards here in Polar Knight stage? Like, it's cold. You'd think the lizards would freeze. <sighs> Sometimes the D-pad don't want to work.
We've only found one of... This is the first music sheet that we found on the level, isn't it? Ouch. <laughs> it still remembered I slightly cracked the checkpoint there. You're, you're getting dangerous there, buddy. Do 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 do. Ooh, there is an Advance Wars map that is actually called Stalingrad. At least on Advance Wars by Web. One of my favorite maps. Do 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 do. I'm not leaving without my money. What am I? Okay, both my I cores are the I core of renewal, of course. I'm like, dang, this is where the I core of bounty would be really nice. Eh, we didn't need it. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is becoming a war stream instead of just Shovel Knight. I mean, Shovel Knight's at war with all these Arctic Wolves. Haha! -ha! You fool. Getting the chest gave me invincibility frames. Oh, there's the other music note. Okay, now we can still do this. Haha! -ha! Propeller dagger. Oh, thank you, Propeller Dagger. Now it's time for Polar Knight. Here we go. Hm. So, my old friend, the day has finally come. This will be our final duel. Should we not lay down our shovels and part as equals? Humph! <laughs> the Order has no equals. Surely you can recognize power. Join us. You've forgotten our oath! What happened to the proud warrior I knew? Humph! <laughs> no more words. The bitter cold will claim you. Yes! Woohoo! Buried in his own snow. That fight can be scary because uh, you can instantly die on those spikes. My shovel is greater than yours, Polar Knight, even though you're using a snow shovel. Ah. <sighs> now, I, I had a strange dream the other day. I was sitting at the campfire. My girlfriend was falling from the sky. But I had this powerful horn. Feet accomplished! Boom! Oh. Wait, let me play my horn first. Oh, I was too busy conducting this the London Philharmonic Orchestra that I forgot to catch my girlfriend. Whoops! Oh, well, it was just a dream. And oh, look! I happened to camp next to a meal ticket! Oh, hunky-dory! <laughs> and now... The end game awaits. And we get the more ominous map music. But first, we gotta go to Frigid Flight. The Grizzled Seer. 
What dangerous cliffs? Planning to go farther? Better learn how to fly! <laughs> okay. We're gonna need Propeller Dagger for this one. Well, that's not what was supposed to happen. Whoops. This is a tricky side stage, because you gotta really know how to use the propeller dagger properly. Oh no! One bag of money. I bet I could make it. I couldn't make it. I was too high to get the bag of money, but too low to actually make it back. Really? Come on, man. Really? How did I not hit the freaking Jelly Bro? That's his official name now, Jelly Bro. At this rate, I really should get the I-Core of Treasure just so I can get my treasure back better. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Nothing I did... Really? First I missed the first bag, it didn't let me do the propeller dagger, and then I missed the pogo Time even though I was voice. even though I was right on there. Do my best impression of Binky the Clown from Garfield, if I can remember what he sounds like. Hey kids! We're just gonna forget about the bags of money! Except the one we can fish with our fishing hook! Greed makes you a worse person, kids! Boy, it's a skeleton here. <laughs> he looks dead bored. Haha. <laughs> Actually, that's turning into Mo the Clown from Ace Attorney. Oh well. All clowns sound the same, don't they? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Why is this world made of snow and ice? go. Oh-ho! That's clever! Gotta let go of the ladder and then immediately fly! I like that! An off-screen secret! Oh boy! A musical... <laughs> a musical sheet! And more money! We lost a bunch of money on that level, but I don't care! All right, time to head back to town. You'll never believe what I have for you, Mr. Bard. <laughs> I've added these to the song list. Um, I have new songs, bro. What would you like to hear? Whoa, you have seven music sheets. Yes, here you go. Wonderful. Let's see. You found high above the land. I penned this track in a mere three hours in front of a live audience. How? Years of study. Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform it at any time. Just ask. Yay. A meal ticket. Hand this to me. I'll get work on my best recipe. What will you make for us today? Will it be another giant sandwich? Nope, it's gonna be an entire roast pig, and we get decked out as an achievement. Congratulations, you're a pig. That seems to be what it's saying. Oh, wow! Well. We're changing up our armor again. We're heading into the end game. I'm gonna need <laughs> every advantage I can get. Let's go back to the Mail of Momentum. This is my personal favorite. 
All right, here we go. Off to the Tower of Fate entrance. For Shovelry. And we get the epic music. Oh, you jerk. And this is going to be a test of everything we've learned throughout our journey. Okay, I hate those. Remember this from King Knight stage? Remember those stupid fish from Mole Knight stage that weren't great? Yeah, they're everywhere. Love the atmosphere of this level, but this actual level is not that fun. Because it introdu it basically is like, all those annoying stage gimmicks are back. But oh well. You can use relics to speed things up, though. Excuse me. A bomb is not very cool. Uh-oh. Give me that turkey. Oh, he just fell off a cliff on his own accord. Okay. Well, thanks for making my life a little easier. Pretty much every checkpoint on this level is going to give you a lot of gems if you break it, but... I'd much rather have the checkpoint itself. Alright, gotta wait for the platforms. The one time I expected one of those dumb fish fiends to pop up, it doesn't. What? I didn't hit anything. They're just like, you, you look like a guy who could afford to lose 3,000 for no reason. I should pull out the face locket. Oh shoot, no, no, no! I don't like this level. This level is pretty annoying. If you're really fast at this part, you can uh, skip this cycle using the propeller dagger, but I am not that fast. Come on! Yeah, this level's about as bad as I remember it being. platform to go up top, then we can do the pogo. Even though the platform is just off screen, you have to wait for it to come back on, otherwise you fall for some reason. Remember what I said back in an earlier stream about how I don't like auto-scrollers because it doesn't make sense why you die just because the screen catches up to you? Yeah, this is kind of the same issue. This is an ugly castle. Well, it's owned by an ugly woman. I mean, what? Enchantress ain't gonna be too happy if I said that. Whoa! No, the money! Well, and, and this guy also died a gruesome death, but I mean... He is working for the Enchantress, so... Oh boy, more chandeliers! Aha! Still have no idea what these freaking rabbit things are. Oh, that's right, the goop samurais.
Alright, here we go. There we are! Beautiful. Oh, the samurai archers. Aha! And just like Lemmings taught us, we can go top route. I do want that dinner plate, though. Oh, yeesh. Just realized I probably wasn't gonna get enough momentum to get across. Out of my sight. What's a rat doing here? Alright. This is definitely a time for the phase locket. Oh, I hate this next room. Because we go back to the silhouettes where you can't really see anything. I see those sparkles, though. I don't care if it makes for good atmosphere. guys out of our way. Like, this part here is not breakable, but the rest of it was. That's not even getting into the part where we reach the invisible pits. Which is right here. See where the rain's not splashing right next to me? Fall right through. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Hey, that's different. That's Lemmings. Completely different style of game. I'm not hiding things from you in that tile set. It's just there for aesthetic purposes only. Oh no! These guys are freaking back! I hate those enemies! They can just push you off a cliff and there's nothing you can do about it. I will need my propeller dagger. The phase locket doesn't even let you escape from the wind either. Out of my way. Like, look at that! I couldn't do anything! I was even on the ground and it pushed me off a cliff, even though he was blowing through the air. Oh great, and he made me forfeit all of my money. Oh great, and we can't even get the money because it's underneath the platform. Whatever. I'll forfeit my money. Uh, let's get out the Chaos Orb. It's the Black Knight! Shovel Knight! 
Stop your meddling and turn back now! This is your last chance! I will reach her, Black Knight, even if I have to go through you. Black Knight, are you guarding my tower? Have you finally decided to join us? You may kneel and pledge your loyalty now. For the last time, I answer to no one! Very well. Here's a tiny taste of the power you spurned. Black Knight! I warned you to stay away! Alright, let's get out the throwing anchor. Whoa! Dang, the Enchantress really powered him up. Nice Iceman power. I am now out of Arcania. Or out of Relic power. Up. Oh. Bye bye. True, nice reference. This has gone far enough. Whatever you've been trying to do, you can't reach her. <laughs> you may be right. She may already <laughs> be lost. But I can't let go of hope. By now, surely you <laughs> see who I'm trying to save. I do. Do you know a way to bring her back? I haven't tried anything beyond words. Her magic is so powerful, I didn't have the courage. J go! Just don't hurt her, or you'll have to answer to me. See you, Black Knight. You might want to get some Advil for that cough of yours. Alright, off to the Tower of Fate, the Ascent. Or actually, no, no, no. Before we do Tower of Fate, the Ascent, there's something very, very important we have to do. It's very, very important that we change our armor to something extremely valuable. Do 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 do. We gotta wear the golden armor. We just gotta. Justice in spades. Love the pun. I think this level's a big improvement over the last one. It still kind of has the gimmicks of the previous levels together. But in a bit more of a fair way. I also like the surprise that waits for us at the end. I mean, pretty much every level in this game has excellent music. Can you imagine trying to do one of these levels without taking any damage at all? It'd be crazy. This is also a level that really rewards you if you collect all the relics. Pogo. Ah, a whole turkey for me? I appreciate it. Oh, yes. Rainbow Barf returns. Probably my favorite gimmick from the game.
Oh no! Why didn't he fall down until I literally was on the only square he was at? He's supposed to fall down before I get there. Oh no, 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 my money! I have lost so much money. Guess I should have worn the red armor. There we go. That's what's supposed to happen. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, come on! I hate that enemy. That enemy, worst enemy in the whole game. I feel like he just is always kills you unless you know exactly where he is ahead of time. And even then, he still will probably kill you instantly. You never encounter that guy in just a normal room. No, it has to be a room filled to the brim with bottomless pits. Let's go. <laughs> I'm sorry, but there's no Tropel Chalice to help you survive bottomless pits. If there was, I would go for that one every time. Oh, thank goodness we were able to kill that guy with the Rainbow Barf platform. Thank you, Rainbow Barf. Oh, yay! Vertical auto-scroller. The second worst kind of auto-scroller. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Thank you, Propeller Dagger. If, I, if it weren't for the Propeller Dagger, I truly would have had to die there. Or lost the musical note, but I didn't want to do that. Oh, okay, hang on. I said it was the second worst. That doesn't mean it's the best. Horizontal Auto Scroller is the best, and by that I mean it's the least worst. Vertical Auto Scroller is worse, and then Diagonal Auto Scroller is the worst. Looking at you, Mario Free. All right. We have a bomb. We have a bomb. We have a carrot. Part of a balanced breakfast. All right, here we go. One of my favorite parts of the game. Oh, now this, this is rich. Who let this peasant in here to spoil our sumptuous supper? Hardly surprised that you've yet again set foot where you don't belong. We should <laughs> punish you. You're in deep now. We want a rematch. My new plans have no flaws. You can't win this time. A battle royale then? Marvelous. Who will go first? Humph. <laughs> Pass the salt. <laughs> we get to fight every boss over again. It's a random order, but you'll always fight Polar Knight first, second, or third because of the instant death uh, danger. Oh, yes! Thank you, Chaos Orb. Oh boy, Spectre Knight. 
We should be a little bit easier now that we have the four-way anchor, though. Uh oh, I'm out of uh, the I'm out of relic of use. But now I'm out of relic use. Even though he's like supposed to be the second boss, I've always thought Spectre Knight was like the toughest of the knights. Oh, he turned out the lights. Now how are they supposed to eat their dinner? There we go. Bye, Spectre Knight. Oh boy, Propeller Knight. At least they're kind enough to give me some more mana, as well as the Thanksgiving turkey. Although, thankfully, Propeller Knight can't one-hit kill you in the rematch. That would require blowing holes in the kitchen table. Which the other knights just can't have. Bye-bye! Oh, yes. So it turns out Tinker Knight is really easy. Bye-bye! <laughs> Feet accomplished, Relic Round Table. <laughs> he instantly dies to his mobile gear. But not in the second phase. Him instantly dying to his own weapon is an homage to Metal Man, who did the same thing in Mega Man 2. Oh man, I'm sucking at this fight. I remember you getting more mana for these fights. Oh yeah, we never showed off this part. Now we gotta pogo off the bombs in order to get up here. Bye, Tinker Tank. Oh yeah, my favorite fight. Hi, Plague Knight. He's the resident quick man of the game. Very random. But has such a great boss of Psalm. I can jump to Plague Knight. Bye-bye. Oh, it's treasure! Dude, you just flooded the whole dining room. King Knight's still eating, you know. Treasure Knight's always been one of the easier knights. He's huge and doesn't have a lot of dangerous attacks. And doesn't he doesn't move a whole lot either, allowing you to just rapid fire stab him. Oh no! Hi, King Knight. I was kind of hoping we'd fight you last. Being the first boss and everything, it would be funny. Huzzah! Let us battle henceforth.
Du, 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 du. <laughs> I love how we keep killing him whenever his does the little trumpet blowing attack. Oh, Mole Knight, you're still around. Mole Knight's also very easy. Bye bye. Oh, hoo -hoo. thank goodness they're all grabbing on. <laughs> Give us a hand, Shovel Knight! You wouldn't leave us to hang here, would you? Hmm, I don't know if we should help them or not. Nah, we should help them. There you go, everybody. I let you back up. No amount of wealth is worth the heartache that awaits you. Good luck, doomed hero. Well, that's not ominous or anything. I have to hand it to you. You have superior digging technique. We should share notes. My castle, my luxury, my fiefdoms, my chandeliers! Curse you, Shovel Knight! Although, I must say your armor is resplendent. I can see you've picked up on my style. <laughs> That's why I wore the armor. My defeat is of no concern. The Enchantress cannot be stopped by any mere mortal. I may not have your strength, <laughs> but I am still far more clever, so watch out. <laughs> Ah, how invigorating! How uplifting! If all your quests are this much fun, I should go with you. There are substantial inadequacies in my hydraulic actuators. Considerable iteration is warranted. I meant what I said. You should still join us. Well, so long, everybody. All right. Well, we can head back and give over the, uh, songs to the bard. Hello, Mr. Bard. Oh, you have four music sheets. There you go. Welcome. Oh, you found the inner struggle. Tippany rolls might be a shortcut to strum and drain, but I've no shame, friend knight. Now that I have this music sheet, you can perform at any time. Which ones am I missing? I'm missing... I'm missing a song from... Really? <laughs> the turbo tunnel. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, so we're actually... Are we missing one in the armor outpost? Well, I had to go to the armor outpost to change my armor anyways, but still. We'll go back to the blue armor. Original is best. got the the psalm there. There's nothing else in here, so hmm. What psalm are we missing then? I thought I got everything. Was it in the Hall of Champions? Maybe I didn't explore everything in the hall. I thought I did. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Like, we went in here because this is where we had to go to get the, uh, battle toads.
I guess the alchemy coin can be used to figure out where the hidden floors are. Because it does travel on the ground. But at this point, I don't really have any use for the alchemy coin. We did go up here, right? Yeah. I am puzzled, then. Where is the missing music sheet? Curiouser and curiouser. Is there one in the Trouble Pond that we missed? Oh, also, while we're here. Oh, uh, no thanks. I'm sorry, Trouble King, but here. What do you think you're doing, mortal? I was just fishing in your pond. <laughs> he does not like it if you fish in the Trouble Pond. Wait, I have a music sheet now? But I already handed it over to him. Where did I get that? You found Walt's... Oh. Did I get it for fishing in his pond? Oh, that's that's where it was. I had to fish in his pond in order to get... Okay. Alright. I mean... I forgot about that. Alright. We can head off to the final level then. Tower of Fate, question mark? Get digging. Ooh, I love the stained glass. Oh boy, the famous the blocks fly at you puzzles. Straight out of Zelda. <laughs> Hey, I wasn't even wearing the icy armor. Come on. Uh, this looks like a job for the phase locket. When in doubt, phase locket. I need cash now. I was about to say, if we time it just right, maybe we can get the uh, bag of gold. But I don't think so. I always almost end up missing this. Or actually missing this. Look at all those music notes. Oh, you already have the i -cores. Yes. I don't like this part with the, where it's often like, oh, you just gotta jump and figure out if the platforms are gonna appear for you. Especially since you are on a time limit right here. If you spend too long on the platform, it will disappear when you, uh, before you are able to leave it. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Unbreakable checkpoint, and here we go. It's Enchantress time. It's a beautiful night, isn't it? Shield Knight! Come with me! Let us leave this place! How pitiful, clinging to false hope, chasing ghosts. So, have you come to slay me, Knight, to avenge your beloved? Gaze into my eyes, see how fearful I am. Watch me cower as you draw your blade. 
I don't need a blade to fight evil, Shield Knight. I know you aren't lost forever. You haven't the slightest hope of defeating me, but I won't stop you from trying. So please, let us dance together into the abyss. And the flare rod stinks. Gets deflected by everything. Alright. Great, she's at the bottom of the screen. That's not where I want her to be. Because I can't safely attack her from there. Get back up here, you coward. Oh, wow, okay, okay. Yeah, yes! Bye, Enchantress. And yeah, Shield Knight's back. Catch her, just like in my dreams. You caught me. If only I had known, I would have come sooner. <laughs> you knew I was still there, even though it seemed hopeless. You never gave up on me. I will never give up on you. I will follow you to the end of the world. It appears that maybe you have. What's happening? Oh no. When the amulet shattered, the magic within it was released. It's already gathering. It will escape and wreak havoc on everything. Unless we stop it. Unless we stop it. We can destroy it for good, here and now. But we're both weak from battle. I've never been more ready. Come on, Shovel Knight. Let's fight together like old times. Now, stay close to me. Yay, full refill on everything. Um, I'm sorry. Do we not get the final boss music? There we go! Like, jeez, that was delayed. We get to pogo off of Shield Knight to smack the Enchantress around. Or, like, the, the power of the amulet. That's how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> Thank you, Shield Knight! <laughs> this is a cool final boss. I, I like getting to team up with Shield Knight. Um, <clears throat> well, that didn't work. Sorry, Shield Knight, I have very bad aim. Easy. Shumite, why did you move to the center? Where I clearly wasn't? There we go. Whew. It's over, Shovel Knight. This place is falling apart. We have to get out of here. Let's go. I know a path. Shield Knight! Black Knight! Thank goodness you're here. Shovel Knight is wounded. Take him and get outside. No! I can't leave you behind! How will you escape? This magic is too strong. I can't hold out much longer. Run! You can't deflect it! It will tear you apart! I'm so happy I got to see you both one last time. 
Shield Knight! Go! Take Shovel Knight! Save him! Promise me you'll save him! He's like, Duh. Why do I have to be the good guy? more ways than one. And the Tower of Fate is sinking down! Yeah! They did it! Pride more keep, King Knight. We got the Griffin, the Rats, the Magicians, the Knights, and King Pride more is back on the throne, and oh, the rightful King returns, and King Knight has to clean the floors. No! I hate cleaning floors! The Trouble Pond! Oh hey, he gets to dance with the dancing girl. Ah. Let the celebrations begin. The Lich Yard, home of Spectre Knight. The life of the party, really? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, King Knight does deserve it. More on that when we play King Knight's story. Iron Whale, Treasure Knight. Oh, ill-gotten gains reclaimed. Treasure Knight, did you get that money from stealing? Again? The Explodatorium, home of Plague Knight. <laughs> Advanced potion class! <laughs> Mr. Plague Knight, you've just earned a double detention with me every day for the rest of your life. <laughs> the Lost City, Mole Knight. Excavations and Expeditions. Still don't know why his head is on fire. The Wandering Travelers. We got the Goopy Samurais. Oh, but watch out, you got Reese, Mr. Hat, the Baz, and the Phantom Striker. Always ready for battle. Baz got his own crew! Yeah! The Flying Machine, home of Propeller Knight. Living the life carefree. Carefree? That did not describe that stage at all. <laughs> But I guess he it's the romantic area. The clock tower clockwork tower, home of Tinker Knight. Oh, this this series has only just begun. Toys for the children! Yay, the children! Tinker Knight is helping Santa out a little bit. Stranded ship, polar knight. What you doing there, Polar Knight? Nothing. He's like, I'm not turning my land into anything. Safe at last. I kept my promise, Shield Knight. Rest well, Shovel Knight, until we meet again. And now he's probably going to blame Shovel Knight for Shield Knight dying. Feat accomplished! Victory! And Shovel of Hope. Thank you, everybody, for making this game. This is such a good game. If this game looks fun, I highly recommend you get it yourself and play it. And by the way, so there are four campaigns. Would you believe me if I told you that the Shovel Knight campaign is my least favorite out of the four campaigns? Because it is! Don't get me wrong, it's still really good. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> but that just is, that's not here to tell you that Shovel Knight's bad. It's here to tell you that the other campaigns are even better. Directors for a day. <laughs> Matt and Wooly from Two Best Friends Play? Wait, really? 
They got a special thanks. Nice. Their bully let's play is hilarious. Maybe they kind of gave the game a bit of a Colbert bump, so to speak. To speak the TV tropes language. Production babies. Does that just mean people that were born during the development that are like kind of related to the people who worked on it? <laughs> Axe Studios! That's an unfortunate name. Are we going to see the credits every time we finish a campaign? Maybe, but I think you can also skip the credits. But we're not skipping them the first time. Fuzzy Wuzzy Games. Oh, yes. I love Fuzzy Wuzzy Games. I'm also not sure if we're going to try to get all the feats in this game, because that might require playing the game multiple times. Each campaign multiple times. I don't know. Maybe we'll come back to that in a challenge stream or something. Well, Fuzzy Wuzzy Kitties are the best. And all the Kickstarter backers, you made this happen. Yeah, that's true. Oh, dude! They actually include that in the credits? Current any percent speedrun record? Dude, that's so cool. I always love it when game developers are, like, supportive of the speedrunning communities. Oftentimes, the speedrunners end up learning more about the game than the people who made it. The Battletoads characters appear courtesy of Microsoft. Yep. Thanks, Microsoft, for letting that happen. Digging Log! Uh-oh. Oh, no. This is gonna be bad. <laughs> we never died in the Lich Yard! Which is funny, because that's literally... Is the Lich Yard the only place we didn't die in? Guys, ironically, the Lich Yard, the land that's literally themed after death, was the only place that we never died in. What the heck? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Total game completion, 100%. Yes, thank you for playing, produced by Yacht Club Games. No, thank you, Yacht Club Games. She's alive, somehow! Now we can sleep by the campfire together. Aw. Yay, she survived. And Smokey the Bear is still looking on, just like... How dare you light a fire in the middle of the woods. The end. Aw, oh, yeah. Yacht Club Games. You know what's the most exciting thing about winning? When you win. I love that feeling. So do I. New Game Plus available. A new quest awaits. Select a completed Shovel Knight profile to begin. Unlock Challenge Mode. Sharpen thy shovel with new Shovel Knight challenges. Select Challenge Mode to be... Oh! Unlock Sound Test. Listen and enjoy the mute to the music... Listen to and enjoy the music of Shovel Knight. Select Sound Test. Cool. Let's go to Challenge Mode. We got some time. Uh, anchors away! Survive an endless onslaught of propeller rats. This sounds fun. We gotta survive for 50 seconds. Oh, great! And we got bare bones equipment. And one health! I gotta say, this is not my idea of a fun Friday night. Some of these challenges get absolutely brutal, by the way. Like, this is the first one. Jeez, it's an 8-bit game, and it's lagging, because there are too many enemies on screen. Challenge clear! Phew! <laughs> Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. Wow, first try, though. Dirt Clod Dive. Bounce off of those Dirt Clods to victory. Sure. Reach the goal. Um... Uh, wait, what?
Oh, I see. Ho oh, ho ho! This is nasty! Oh! Yeah, these are tricky. Gotta think about it. But at least the challenges are pretty short. TikTok Tower. Prevail on a crazy elevator ride without swinging the shovel. No shovel swinging allowed, folks. I gotta admit, when they said that this was gonna be an elevator ride, I didn't think that they were... Uh, I didn't think it would be in the Explodatorium. I thought it was gonna be in the Clock Tower. What the heck? Okay, hang on. Can we pogo at least? Oh, okay, we can pogo. That all right? That makes sense. I'm like, how the heck do we do this without pogoing? We can't swing the shot. Here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, ho, ho, ho. whoa, 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 whoa. I do not want to go up there. Oh, come on. That end part is evil. Um, I couldn't pogo on the gears because they were off screen? That ain't how physics work. At least we get the Explodatorium music. Ouch! Also, why am I taking a full heart of damage from this? This isn't New Game Plus. New Game Plus is basically the game, but you take double damage. Ouch. Man, I am bad! at pogoing off of these. Gotta get that money. I need that money. I still find it very stupid that you can't pogo off the gears, like, half the time. <laughs> oh, well, Donkey Kong Country Returns is a rough one. Get out of the way. There we go. Man, that one was tough. Especially at the end there, but... We made it in the end. 
Double bubble. Stay atop of the rising tide of bubbles. Great. Vertical auto score again. I also have to remember, I can now do the shovel swing. Like, why can't I go higher? I literally just have to wait for the stupid screen to stop scrolling. What the? Oh, what? How did I pop them both with one shovel pogo? I only landed on one. Like, why can't I go faster than the game wants me to go? I understand having to pick up, take a, keep a minimum pace, but why do I have, why are you limiting me on how fast I can go? If I want to go faster, let me go faster. Alright, where's this going to lead to? I love not being able to see what's above me when I pogo. Okay! Well, that was rude, it just wasn't spawning bubbles anymore. I somehow popped all three bubbles at the same time with one pogo. Wait, what did I- why did I do that? I don't want to kill the enemies, I want to just pogo off them as platforms. We moving, we grooving. Good loud. Hey Proximo, welcome. We uh we finished with the main campaign. We're now just finishing up the stream by doing some of these challenges. Which are uh challenging, as the name implies. Excuse me? What the heck? When is he gonna turn not electric? Oh, that's the one jellyfish in the entire in game that doesn't ever turn not electric. Like, really? Those guys are supposed to stay electric for, like, a couple seconds and then turn normal. I'm calling foul on that one, Shovel Knight. You literally introduced a brand new enemy type that looks exactly the same as a different enemy type, just to screw with the player. That would be like if Zelda introduced, like, oh, hey, it's the wall map. What hit me? What hit me? Nothing hit me! This is why auto-scrollers are garbage. You can get hit by stuff that's not even loaded on the screen yet, but you still get hit. They load the hitboxes on screen before they actually load the graphics. Because, yeah, that makes sense. No, like, imagine if Zelda is like, hey, it's a wall master. Oh, but this wall master, if you don't get grabbed by it, you go back to the start of the dungeon. But it looks exactly the same as the other wall master. Like, that would be so stupid. That's effectively what Shovel Knight just did at the end here.
Okay, so now I know we gotta go over the stupid jellyfish. Super dumb! But there we go. Challenge is complete. We did it. Alright, well. Let me do that. I want to take a look at the feats. Alright, what do you mean I didn't obtain... Oh, I didn't return all the music scrolls. Well, we gotta make sure we do that. Hang on, we can't just finish the game without giving the bard back all of his music. Back to the village. Do 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 do. Hey, dude! Huzzah! You have five music sheets! Wonderful! You found a return to order! The order is vanquished! Hooray! Perhaps I can afford a studio in this wretched town. Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform any time! Unbelievable! You've recovered every single opus in my ouvre! A chromed-out curator, a his heroic historian! You may have saved the village, but your real contribution is to the fine arts! Bravissimo! That's what I was looking for. Doo-doo-doo! So if we go to feats now, okay. So we did all that. Oh, that's the wrong one. That's the next campaign. We have to hit enemies with a reflected projectile 30 times. Okay, that'll that'll be uh, pretty easy. Finish new game plus. Finish a stage without taking damage. Finish the game without dying. Finish the game without spending any money. Finish the game without falling into a bottomless pit. Destroy every possible checkpoint in the game. Defeat an enemy with the flare wand from more than 25 blocks away. Collect 2,000 worth of gold lying on spikes while using the phase locket. Destroy five enemies within five seconds using chaos spheres. Hang in the air for more than four seconds using the dust knuckles. Bounce on the same alchemy coin five times in a row. Defeat free enemies with one throwing anchor. Defeat free enemies using the propeller dagger without touching the ground. Run over five enemies using the same mobile gear. Beat the game without collecting any relics. Finish the game within one hour, 30 minutes. Have 50,000 gold on hand. Finish a level and swing the shovel blade fewer than 20 times. Finish a level without eating any food. I'm impossible. That's the toughest achievement. Finish off any boss using the ground spark technique. Finish off the Black Knight with a reflected shot. Uh, don't collect any gold from an entire order of middle quarter stage. Bounce on the ki hoop kids hoop for five seconds. Okay, hang on. We can, we can do some of these. Uh, no, I didn't want you to hit the wall. I wanted you to bounce off the wall. Okay, hoop kid, your hoop is mine. Actually, this might be a bit trickier than it looks. What? Oh, that's not fair. It fell under the trebuchet. There we go, feet accomplished Hooper. Oh, Mr. Hooper. The alchemy coin one I'm going to have to think about. Yeah, a lot of feats that we haven't done. And I, I think the feats in this are actually pretty good. It, re it requires you to play the game in interesting ways. But that's going to do it for Shovel Knight's campaign. Now, next time, on Wednesday's stream, we have a couple of options, folks. We have a couple of options for Wednesday's stream. I could do Shovel Knight's campaign New Game Plus. I could continue doing Shovel Knight challenges, I could try getting some of the feats in Shovel Knight's story, or we could move on to the second campaign, which is Plague Knight's campaign. So if people want, if people have a strong preference one way or another, you can let me know, and that might influence the outcome of Wednesday's stream. We got some interesting options. New Game Plus in Shovel Knight would be a lot quicker than the regular campaign. Probably would finish it in one or two streams. So. Something to think about. You can feel free to hit me up in Discord or YouTube. Or right now, we gotta vote for Plague Knight already. Well, I do love Plague Knight. Plague Knight's campaign is actually my favorite campaign. Which is, it's funny, because it's most people's least favorite campaign. But no, I love Plague Knight. He, he plays so fun. 
But regardless, I think that's all the time we have for today. Thanks for joining in, everybody. This is definitely a lot of fun to play, and look forward to seeing more of Shovel Knight next time on Wednesday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a fantastic rest of your night, and God bless everybody.